Здравствуйте, дорогие Hello, друзья. Friends. Мы с вами уже channel, you can watch на моем канале посмотреть видео, videos, for example, the video devoted to the determination of sexual relation or ideas and rules of active blending, treating of TMT and so on. But in general, theory is more fully understandable with practice and experience. That series of our videos are devoted to the demonstration only of clinical cases because this is where all your skills you've received during training and through the experience process are reflected. Exactly, its proper and detailed use allows you to achieve excellent results. And for me, these cases make it possible to show how this knowledge are useful in dental practice. This is the case where we provide the prosthetics to the patient with fixed construction on the implants on the lower jaw. We would like to install the implants in the upper jaw as well, but they weren't hard tissues enough, so we decided to use a simple removable prosthesis there. Pay attention to what the situation was at the moment of the patient referring. We extracted the remaining teeth on the upper jaw and some on the lower jaw as they were bad. Look at the prosthesis on the upper jaw, it is with an open palate side. It's probably that the patient asked for it, not the doctor invented to do that. It is no fact that removal prosthesis is fixed by its wide ear area, but patients often don't like it as it causes a pressure and takes a place in the oral cavity. It's a lack of space for the tone and causes discomfort. So here at this stage, just analyzing the patient's or prosthesis, you can find out a lot. And it can help you in our practice and in your work with the patient if you understand why this work has been done exactly in this way, why it was grinded, etc. So we understand that it is a difficult man. So, what does it still matter for the assessment of old work? It is to the inclination and look so called stuff. The incisors are seen to be more extruded than other teeth. Also, notice the difference between the widths of the distal areas between the upper and lower tooth arches. It can be stated that upper arch width is reduced and it will lead to crossbite. And we understand there could be a number of problems we must solve somehow. A distal bite reduced width of the jaws. Most likely it was class 2 division 2 according to orthodontic terminology. And we provide a prophylometric analysis to understand the patient condition and to observe the face proportions. Here we have a retrognatic position of the upper jaw and it gives us one bad aesthetic moment, retrusion of the upper lip tissues. You see, at this stage of planning the treatment, we must take into account many factors, including aesthetic ones, because it's not just white teeth bleach or A1, A2 color and that's all. No, it's a rose aesthetics and lip position. So you can see that in this case I model the front part, it is a temporary removal prosthesis to make the right position of the upper lip. And there are special angles that allow us to control this moment. If you watch a video about registration of the central relation, you will see that patients with full identia will registrate the central relation with aluminum wax. You can see it here. That is, we don't hit the full basis wax, but only the aluminum wax part in order not to make a kind of pushing. 
для того, чтобы не было продавливания. И Next, дальше я провожу the registration and in this case on temporary prosthesis. You see the complicated patients often require more than one registration and we double check ourselves. And I always refer you to my previous video and when registering the central relation at first, it is doubtful to get it, especially that existence relation you need if the patient has some dysfunctional problems. Probably you'll get FP1. So those stages of preprosthetic preparation, when you sequentially proceed from temporary prosthetics to permanent, allow you to eliminate the spasm, pain, and different kinds of problems and get the most accurate relation for the jaw, you can register and then do permanent prosthetics. In this case, we use noble implants, noble select. You may ask why. I usually work with the implants and glass, but at the whole time of my practice, I've used 15 till 20 systems at all times, and at my clinic we use at least 5-6 systems. It is extremely disadvantageous for the business, but I've investigated the matter a lot and use different types of system according to the fact that certain systems cannot replace all. It can be a universal. We use appropriate systems for suitable clinical cases. In this case, we used select because the were not soft tissues enough and it can be expected for exposed part of an implant. There wasn't bone tissue height enough and in order not to provide augmentation and surgical stages if the denotation implant occurs were supposed to get a polished cervical zone in the soft tissue area and also is suitable for us so that we create proper conditions for hygiene. You see, I provide one more registration of the upper relationship, but with a temporary fixed prosthesis on the lower jaw. The registration Pay attention, I use an aluminum wax and assess in the oral cavity. I took some photos of faces as it is important for me as a dental technician to see the relation of all structures, center line, canal line, for his further work. We formed the wax of the lower template as tight as we can to make the optimal margin and evaluate that occlusion we will have. So, in this part, we faced with this clinical case and with clinical stages of the work, from the phase of evaluation and work with the physiological aspect, the evaluation of aesthetic parameters at the stage of prophylometric analysis. The cephalometric analysis is carried out as well for the video evaluation and evaluation of Jaws relationship. We get a lot of information at this stage. The temporary prosthetics is carried out, we can let the patient be without teeth, so there are some intermediate stages as well. And in our next video, we'll add with the issue of temporary prosthetics, which is a prototype of permanent prosthetics. If you've watched some videos at this channel, you must have seen that I provide to the patient a stage with special temporary crowns, which are the inherently the prototypes of permanent work. It is extremely important as we've got a proper height and relation and can control all of that at the temporary prosthetic stage. In the cases we need to install a half of a construction or to make the necessary adjustments, we can replace a prototype with a permanent crown and vice versa at any time. So here is a moment of control of occlusion or jaw relationship, the patient condition or construction 
interchangeability in the case you want to add something at the stage of permanent work. And in the next video we'll observe the issue of prototype works grinding and you'll see how we finished this work. I'm very and very grateful for your questions. Subscribe to our channel, like it, it is very important for us. And welcome to our courses. Thank you for your attention. See you.